Doppler 10 meteorologist Jeff Booth here. Our full moon this month, well, it's something special. It's actually known as the full sturgeon moon because fish were easily caught this time of year, but that's not what makes this full moon special. It's also known as a seasonal blue moon. And well, I'm going to start off and say the moon is not going to look blue. However, we call this term a blue moon. It's become a term in popular culture because it's something that doesn't happen very often. So what is a blue moon? Well, it can be one of two things. A calendrical blue moon, that would be the second full moon in a month that has two of them. So maybe you have a full moon on the first of the month and you got a full moon on the 30th. So that second one, that would be known as a blue moon. Also, the third full moon in a season with four full moons. So most seasons only have three full moons, but this one, well, it's a little bit different. We had our first full moon just after the summer solstice. That was the strawberry moon in the month of July. We had the buck moon and then obviously this month is the full sturgeon moon. Then the last full moon of the season, the last full moon of summer 2021, that's going to be just a couple of days before the autumnal equinox. So technically the harvest moon will be the last full moon of the summer. So this third one in here, well, that's what we call the blue moon. Again, most seasons only have three full moons, but this summer, well, it had four of them, and these don't happen very often. As I mentioned, seasonal and calendrical blue moons, well, there's something that happened generally every roughly two to three years, really on average of about two and a half to three years. Our next seasonal blue moon will be in August of 2024, then May of 2027, then August of 2029. Again, every two and a half to about three years. Uh, the next calendrical blue moon will be in August of 2023. The next one after that will be in May of 2026 and then after that it will be December of 2028. So again, something that doesn't happen very often, hence the term once in a blue moon. So there you go. Uh, again, that full moon did not look blue, will not look blue. However, though, it's something that doesn't happen very often, so we call it a blue moon. So hopefully uh, you enjoy that special full moon that we have this month. We won't have another one for a while. In fact, we'll have another one for once in a blue moon. I'm Doppler 10 meteorologist Jeff Booth.